welcome back to my channel. It's Essence Tierra here for all of my new subbies. Welcome, and for all of my other subscribers, welcome back to your gang. Girlfriend, you gotta get it right. Girlfriend, you gotta learn to fight. Girlfriend, you gotta get it right. Keep your eyes on the prize. Today, I'm coming to you guys with a very helpful video. First of all, it's getting hot outside. I know y'all know that. It's hot where I'm at. And so, with that being said, a lot of us ladies, including myself, I'm not excluding me, you know, when it get hot outside, everything just get like sweaty and compacted and just, whoo. And like all of us know, when areas get like that, it starts to get kind of stinky. And we want to avoid that. We don't want to stink. We don't want to stink none 2019 period at all and i'm gonna help you guys with that so i'm just gonna tell you guys some of the things that i use or that i look for when i go to the dollar general that way you're not spending that much money on these products and you can make sure that you are still smelling really good when you're outside when you're with your friends when you're with your boo you don't want to be stinking this video is not sponsored at all these are literally products that i use that i have in my closet that i have double of that i go and rack up on every time i go to the dollar general you can also find these in the family dollar store as well dollar tree not so much because they don't really have um like a lot of name brand stuff i like my stuff to be name brand i don't know maybe you don't but i do so if you guys want to make sure you are not smelling bad this summer then just keep on watching this video okay so one of the very first things that i always get from the dollar general and i actually talk about this on my channel a lot apple cider vinegar they do sell this in the family dollar it's about five to six dollars for this you can also get it at walmart but since this is a family dollar haul we're gonna just pretty much talk about um what they have at dollar general they sell this you guys i can't explain enough how healthy this is for you not only that um it's super good for your body but it also gets rid of any bacteria that the body does not need. It helps fight it off as well. And so a lot of girls get yeast infections or um, bacterial vaginosis, different things like that because the pH balance is off and you're getting more bacteria than you need. So it's creating yeast. If you don't want that issue, go ahead and take apple cider vinegar. I guarantee you it will definitely stop. And y'all know yeast infections don't smell good, so... Mm, we'll need that another thing that i always get from dollar general is deodorant and i use dove you guys i love dove and i always get original clean just because the scents you know they get mm -mm. something about scent it's like the scent smell good until you start to get a little musty then the scent just like and it just becomes too freaking much but if you get original it doesn't have that extra smell literally just smells like baby powder and I love it. It's the best. It's easy to get. I actually get it in the two packs. And this is also about $5. And it's always on sale too sometimes when you go into Family Dollar General. So I always pretty much rack up on this. That way we're not smelling musty and stank. You know, you guys can use whatever you use. But other brands like Secret and I don't know any other ones. But those just don't work for me. Dove lasts the longest. It feels the most clean and um, it's really good for my skin as well. The next thing that I always get from the Dollar General is my tampons. I use the Tampax Pearl and I get them in three different sizes. I love tampons. Now, everybody not ready for tampons. I'm not telling you to go out and buy a box of tampons if you never use tampons. But what I will say is that I'm not a super huge um, fan of pads, especially during the summer. Because number one, it's super uncomfortable. And two, when you bleed on the pad, I know this is getting TMI. But when you bleed on the pad and you're not changing it, like really the moment you bleed out, which makes it, you know, pretty much pointless. It can start to stink because it's literally just sitting on you. It's sitting in your pants. It's sitting on your vagina. And if you're not are able to change it as soon as you smell the smell, y'all, we could smell it. Like, mm-mm. When it starts to get hot outside, you get sweaty down there. And, you know, you just kind of, 
you're causing more more odor to be down there versus if you have on a tampon you're literally sticking it up in you um, and you can't smell anything because there's nothing actually sitting on the outside of your skin you just have to make sure that you're changing these regularly and yeah it keeps you super cool down there because you don't have on anything literally but your underwear and a little string that just kind of dangles you know does its thing the next thing that i always buy when i go to dollar general and they also have this at ulta um, because i bought it there first and i realized that it was more expensive at ulta than dollar general so i started getting it from there it is the t um tree hut sugar shea sugar scrub they have so many different flavors so many different scents and also different things so you can get sugar scrub you can get the salt they just have so many different things mm, it smells so good this is the passion fruit and guava basically this is exactly what it says it is it's a sugar scrub so you use this while you're taking a shower or in your bath you just rub it on your skin it definitely exfoliates because it has like the rocks like the hard stuff in it and not only that it keeps your skin smelling so good and you also have like this beautiful glow on you when you're done and we all want to glow in the summer ladies but yeah this is super good for your skin it's definitely hydrating and it actually makes you smell really good and if you pair it with some lotion and some um perfume you'll be smelling really good for the whole day lastly i have a love-hate relationship with this product um, but for some reason, I always just kind of have to have it. It's the Summer Eve, Summer's Eve Simply Sensitive Cleansing Wash. And this is strictly for your um, vagina down there. And it's basically supposed to be good for your pH balance. I've heard that it's not. I've heard that it is. However, I really like the smell of this. Um, it just smells so clean. It's kind of like the Dove. I always get original scent. Scents are like smell good scents are just kind of, I don't really like those, but this is really good. You literally, I don't use this all the time. I always use my Dove soap when I'm taking an actual bath, but if it's kind of like in the middle of the day and I just want to clean up or wash up or I'm about to go out and I don't want to take a shower, but I need to clean up down there. Um, I always use this as my go-to. You literally just have to wet your fingers pour a little um, dab of this on your hand and just kind of massage the area and it'll get soapy and it'll clean out any dirt or tissue or lint whatever you might have down there i absolutely love getting this for that i've had this for a long time just because i don't use it in the shower but it's good for kind of like on the go and they also have wipes in this as well which I do have, but I only want to do five products. But I do have the wipes too, just because you kind of need them throughout the day. Or if you use the bathroom, like do number two. And your butt got, you know, uh, this come in handy for that. Alrighty guys, so that's pretty much it for this video. There are so many good feminine products for us out there. Um, you guys, we just got to use them. We have to keep them in our daily regimen, especially when it's getting hot outside. Because we don't want to stink. We don't want to cause any infections down there. Just because we were careless. And we could have just went to the Dollar General. And got these few little products. And been smelling good the whole summer. So yeah. That's pretty much it. Thank you guys so much for watching this video. I will do a part two. If you believe that this was helpful. Because I have so many products. I just didn't want to make this one video too long. So yeah. Let me know down below in the comments. If you would like to see some more of the products that I use during the summertime. That's pretty much it for this video. Give it a big thumbs up if it was helpful. If you liked it, let me know some things down below in the comments. I will see you guys in my next video. Bye-bye.